So let's talk about SS Table Dump. Probably one of the oldest tools in the Cassandra toolbox, but still really useful. So SS Table Dump was custom built to do one thing. Guess what? Dump an SS table. So it's just that. It takes an SS table and it pulls out the text representation of what's in the file. Now it can do it only in one format and that's JSON. And it gives you all of the data deep down inside of the poor SS table, including things like tombstones and TTLs. It's really good though for things like diagnostics. And you can understand what's happening inside of your data file at a level that you can't get anywhere else. When you look at the output of an SS table dump in this JSON format, you'll see all the different parts of that file. This is one from a 3.0 node, which means that it was after we had a big storage engine change. So some of this is different. If you had this before 3.0, it would look a little different because there was a different file structure. This file structure shows, okay, here's the key, here's the position, the type, which is a row, it breaks down all these pieces into their really small parts. You can see the liveness, like the timestamp that the data was written into the system and the actual values of what they were. So way more information than you ever need and usually a diagnostic problem. You're looking to solve an issue that you may have a bug, you found a bug or something like that. An option to the JSON format is if you use the dash D, which gives you a much more terse output, this gives you pretty much the basics. Here's what's in the file, not a lot of ceremony around it. The JSON is much more structured, of course, and there's a lot more information. This is just the basics. So if you ever find yourself in a situation where you need to know the exact data, this is the tool to use.